Scheduling. Accomplish more work with less downtime with the calendar views in Blue Folder. Scheduling helps you accurately set up your team's days, weeks, months, and even years if necessary. Knowing who's helping who when will build confidence when setting expectations with both your team and your customers. There are multiple areas within Blue Folder that will help you and your staff know who they're helping when. If leveraging customer notifications and or the customer portal, your customers will also have visibility of when to expect your team's help. The main areas within Blue Folder that will help you, your team, and your customers with scheduling are the Personal Dashboard, the Work Orders tab, the Calendar tab, the Customer Portal, and the Mobile Edition. From the Personal Dashboard, you and your team can access your schedule for either one or two days. These appointments and scheduled work orders can be printed simply by clicking the link. You and your team will also have access to your open work orders that can be filtered by today, tomorrow, or maybe today and older. Each user has access to their calendar through the mini calendar. By clicking on the mini calendar, you'll be taken to the calendar tab. The calendar tab will allow you to choose your view, day, week, week agenda, and or month. From these views, depending on permissions, users can create new appointments and new work orders by simply clicking on the date of the event. The work order tab, depending on permissions, will show either all work orders or just my work orders. Here, again, similar to the personal dashboard, work orders can be filtered by today, today only, or today or older. As an admin, dispatcher, scheduler, you can filter down to the actual user who's assigned for let's say all jobs today. This is a great way to stay on top of your team and make sure your team's staying on top of their work. The calendar tab displays all scheduled assignments and appointments. The calendar can be viewed by day, week, month, and availability. To further help your staff zero in on who can help when, the calendar can be filtered by group, as well as toggled between an individual view and a team view. To create new events such as appointments and scheduled assignments, simply click on the date and the day and create a new scheduled work order or an appointment. When looking at the team view, simply click on the day, enter the duration, the subject, and the customer to create new scheduled work orders and assignments. To take action on scheduled assignments and appointments, simply click on the appointment. From there, you can access the work order by clicking on the work order number. You can access the customer by clicking on the customer. You can also edit, reschedule, and print. If you'd like to print team schedules, simply click on print schedules, select your individuals, or select a group. Next, select your options, and print your team schedule for the day. Users can also set the calendar as their default view. Once a user decides which is their preferred view, they simply just set the default. Customers also have access through the customer portal to scheduled assignment information. By logging into the portal, your customer simply just clicks on a work order in question and can access the assignment data such as which technician's coming to help, what day are they coming to help, and what time. Users can access scheduling information in the field using a laptop or a mobile device. Once they log in, they'll land on their dashboard. The dashboard will show them their schedule for that day. Users can get more information about what they're doing by clicking on the calendar. The calendar will display the current day. The calendar can also be toggled by week. To access scheduled assignment and appointment information, all user needs to do is click on the work order to view their assignment. To create new events, simply click on New 
and choose a new scheduled work order or an appointment. For new appointment, click on the appointment and enter the event details. For new scheduled work order, so we click on the work order, enter the description, choose a customer, and save and assign. Next, the user will want to put in the date and the duration of the appointment, as well as any comments that helps the customer, as well as our staff, know what's going on. For questions and help, please feel free to contact Bluefolder or visit us at www.bluefolder.com.